Hey guys, it's Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom and I'm here today planning in my mini happy planner and it's the week of Monday, October 29th to November the 4th. So we've got Halloween and our anniversary this week. My husband and I are celebrating six years, um, but I am actually going to be going with a Halloween theme. Um, I don't really want to do it too matchy to what I did in my classic. So to kind of make sure that I'm not matching, I'm going to be using from the tiny holidays and season sticker pad. I'm going to be going with these two stickers. I'm not terribly sure exactly what I'm doing, but it's cool. We're just going to go with it. I'll put the ghost down here. Um, I have literally no game plan right now. I am just picking up stickers and putting them down and messing it up. It's totally cool. So one of the things like you can pick the stickers back up, but it does kind of curl the edge. Yeah, there you can see it best there. So now I can't really lay it down there. I'm going to struggle a little too much. So I'm going to put it down over here on this edge of the sticker. And I think that's still a little crooked, but it's fine. I use this planner as an on the go planner. So it's just for places that I need to go, errands I need to run, and like shopping lists for things that I need to pick up while I'm out and about. So because of that, I don't need this thankful thought area or whatever it was that I just covered up. Now let's go ahead and use this. I have a cat visiting me now, so if you see her, you'll understand. And look, I finished it. How exciting is it when you finish a sticker page, right? I mean, let's pay no attention to the fact that it was only two stickers on this page and just be like, yay. Um, sorry, I'm, I can be a little bit of a dork and that's fine. Do I want this down here? No, I've got, so we've had the library still and then we also have trick or treating. Our kids do get to trick or treat on Halloween. So I think, ooh, I could just kind of put it and like center it or no, hold on. Hold on next. I need a, I usually put a shopping list on Monday and then one on Friday. I don't know if I'm actually going to be going shopping though at the beginning of the week because we really don't need anything. So yeah, we'll just, we'll stick it up here and then that gives me some space if I need to write like a shopping list or anything, I can do it over there. All right, so we've got those, which is really exciting. Now for trick or treating, I've got the, um, this is the mini seasonal. So it matches most of what's in the, and I have it right here if I can get it under the stack. So this was the original seasonal sticker book from Mambi. So these coordinate with this and I used a, quite a few stickers from here. In my classic, I mean. So in my classic, I lumped together the Boo All Dressed Up and Trick or Treat stickers. So I don't wanna do that, not in here. I wanna to try to keep it a little bit different. Um, so we have this down here, this is Halloween fun, but yes, here, we have a sticker here that says go trick or treating. So that is what I'm going to use. And then I don't think there's any boxes in here, is there? Like, oops. Um, okay, well that's green, like an olive green. That's not going to match. I could just pull in a colorful box. I know I used them. Where are they? Here they are. I film my classic and my minis, my, my plan with me's back to back. So that's why I'm like, I know I have that because like I just used it. All right, so. Oh my goodness, I've used up way more of the gold. So yeah, we'll just use this will be to mark off the library and I think what I'll do is I think I'll stick it like right about here that looks pretty well straight and then that'll let me stick the trick-or-treating sticker oh okay it stuck itself right there it looks like it's been outlined and only part of my circle. 
but that's really not that big of a deal honestly it's not gonna bother me it's just gonna be noticeable yeah so I wonder if this page isn't completely cut properly and if I'll have that issue more or not not sure so anyway I do know I need a shopping list for later in the week because I'm sure something will come up that I'll need to buy that's so cute but I don't think I have anything really to mark off I mean it is our anniversary but since this is like strictly a functional planner I'm not gonna mark off our anniversary so I'm going to take a black check flag from there and it does have some to buy headers but unfortunately they're all green and green is just not gonna go with this so I wonder if I have any from Sanya so Sanya owns Lil Annabelle's plants so I have these by doilies and let's see well the pastels are not going to go but there's kind of like a like a silver like well I mean it's gray it's not this is not a foil cheat so there's a gray which I think would work but then there's also like this orangey is there orange over there it's a really light it's more of like a gold yeah I think we'll go with this orangey color since I have a black flag we'll go with the orange and this way I know that is my shopping list for the week. All right, so I need to just see, I don't think we have anything else really going on. I mean, I have library and trick-or-treating. Soccer is now over. Um, as of right now, I'm filming on Saturday and today's tournament got rained out. I don't know if tomorrow's tournament is going to get rained out or not, but the fields close after this weekend, so it won't get rescheduled until the spring. So we've got nothing else so that means we've got space for deco so let's come back over here and just kind of see what we're working with I guess we can go backwards since I skipped a little bit forward I don't know if I really want to go with this happy Halloween or not because it would have to go over here on this side I guess I could and then it would be kind of layered so maybe maybe I don't know we'll come back to that because I really am just not sure um that's more like fall than Halloween so you got these cute little like potions and then we've got some jack-o-lanterns and ghosts we have ghosts over here though we have some a bat a bat and some candy corn all right so I peeled up all three of the candy corn stickers um, I'm curious, do you guys eat candy corn or no? I don't. Um, just not, where'd it go? Oh, there it is, it's still on me. Um, it's just not something that is my jam. So, yeah. I think I'm actually going to tip this one over on its side. I think that'll look cute. Maybe I'll tip it over on its other side. layered that's cute I actually do like that all right so we've got a little bit of deco there I am going to stick the potions here because I just think that they're really cute or mm, yeah no we'll stick okay yep they're down they're down <laughs> sometimes my sticker makes the decision for me which is what I need sometimes and then we'll go with this cutie right over here just little bits of deco. I don't think I want to put that big happy Halloween sticker down. I think I think just having like a lighter spread. This one's just kind of bothering me having been layered. So hopefully it'll let me have my sticker back and I can replace it. I liked it on its side and everything. I just kind of did not like it layered. So there. I think that's going to be it. Like I said, I don't think I'm going to put down Happy Halloween. I think I'm just going to leave it like this. Because, like, I... I don't know. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just leave it nice and simple. I'm so indecisive, so 
it's fine. But this is how it's going to be. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos. And actually, if you hit the notification bell, it will give you like a pop-up notification every time I upload if you want to be like one of the first to see each new video. And then also just be sure to be following me over on Instagram over there. I'm at Coffee Planner Mom, so you can check out some of my fun posts over there. And I will see you guys later.